This video is going to discuss the grades 6 through 8 Park Equation Editor. First thing to remember, this is not a calculator. Repeat, not a calculator. When taking the Park Assessment, when asked, you should use this to record your answer. It's important to note there are two types of equation editors. The Basic Equation Editor and the Open Response Equation Editor. The main difference is the basic equation editor, you can only enter math, such as numbers, math symbols, and letters used to represent numbers. The open response equation editor allows you to enter math, numbers, symbols, letters, but you can also enter text, such as words and punctuation. I'm going to show you exactly what these will look like. So we're going to navigate to the grade 6 through 8 part basic equation editor. First thing to notice, if I'm a student, there's nothing here you need to know to click this box. Once you click this box, you will then have options. If I click off the box, it goes away. So notice, if you hover, as with all park buttons, it will tell you exactly what you have. Undo, redo, clear all, plus sign, minus sign, time sign, division sign, fraction, mixed number, power, square root, cube root, equal, parentheses, and percent sign. But watch what happens when I click the down arrow. I have more. I have the plus minus sign, negative sign, times dot, division, division slash, bracket, absolute value, less than, greater than, less than or equal, greater than or equal, degree sign, and constant pi. Remember, this is not a calculator. It is used to represent your thoughts. The arrow will make it go small. Clicking off will make everything go away. Also remember that there are no numbers on the equation editor. You have to use your keyboard. So as a very basic example, 4 plus 3 equals 7. Okay, That's the basic equation editor. If I advance to the open response equation editor, notice right above words and math. So I can use uh, both words and math here. As, as before, there's nothing here. But once I click, up comes what I need. Now notice, I'm going to collapse everything. You have three different categories here that you need to know everything inside. Math symbols, relations, and geometry. Over here, we have, as usual, undo, redo, and clear all. Okay. So if I expand the math symbols, the plus sign, the minus sign, the time sign, division sign, plus minus sign, negative sign, times dot, division slash, equal, not equal, fraction, mixed number, power, square root, cube root, constant pi, parentheses, degree sign, and absolute value. I'm going to collapse math symbols and I'm going to go to relations equal, not equal, similar, not similar, less than, greater than, approximately equal, not approximately equal, less than or equal, greater than or equal, congruent, not congruent. I'm going to collapse relations and I'm going to open up geometry. Ray, line, line segment, parallel, perpendicular, angle, angle measure, triangle, parallelogram, and circle. Okay. Remember, the open response equation editor allows you to type words. Okay. And then you simply have to use all of your math symbols, your relations, and your geometry to solve whatever problem comes in front of you. I'm going to obviously put a very easy problem in there just to show you uh, what would happen. If I want to clear everything, everything is cleared. Okay, That is the grade 6 through 8 uh, park, both basic and open response equation editor. Remember, if you took nothing else away from this video, it is not a calculator. Good luck.